I don't know, I thought we handed them all out already. It says it's to all of us. That's weird. What's inside? It's a book. Santa Claus is coming to town. Once upon a time in the city of Langley. Why Langley? I don't know, keep going. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Old Saint Nick is sat on the chimney, drinking his sorrows away. He begins to lose balance as he gets to his feet, and jolly old Saint Nicholas goes tumbling off the roof, landing with a thud. What was that? Is, is your dad on the roof? No, my parents are on vacation in Cuba. Is that Santa? Wait, yeah, that is Santa. That's not Santa, that's probably just some drunk guy that fell off my roof. Who is it then? I don't know, let's go back inside. Don't you think it's weird the stories come to life? It's just a coincidence. Oh, really? Let's keep reading. Uh, is that a new story? Evil elf on the shelf. Many think that if you touch the elf on the shelf, it'll lose its magic. But really, it'll be charmed by an evil spirit. Beware those who possess one. You have an elf on the shelf? No, not that I know of. Why? Well, there's one right there. What? You know what, guys? I don't really feel like caroling tonight. Oh, um, okay. Bye! Listen here, I'm not buying your magic act. I know you're not real. Gingerbread witch. Little did they know, Ashley didn't listen to the elf's forewarning. She touched the elf, awakening the evil spirit inside. She was whisked away to a place like Limbo, alive but not. She must be rescued by Christmas Eve, or she will be lost forever. In order to find the first clue, the three must go to the forest of the gingerbread witch. Follow the gingerbread trail to the woman. She will give wise advice, but beware the eggnog. The witch will only let children visit if they're in disguise of an elf? Elf. <gasps> These are so ugly. You think yours are ugly? What the hell am I wearing? Okay, let's just go find that witch and save Ashley. Amazing you.
The cookie stop here. Where do we go now? The witch is supposed to be here. Oh, ginger witch, where are you? You called? Uh, we were told you could help us find our friend, Ashley. Ah, yes, the girl in limbo. Where is she then? I will get to that, my dear, but first, how about a nice cup? Of eggnog. Mm, yes, please. <laughs> there are many, there are many trees. trees. The earth, the earth is, spinning. is spinning. You always see trees because we're in a forest and the earth is always spinning. Is this what drinking eggnog feels like? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Ashley? What? Nick, Nick, you were supposed, supposed to drink the eggnog, you idiot! Wake, Wake up! up. <laughs> what just happened? Oh, thank God, we're not in those ugly costumes anymore! Look, it's Ashley! What? what? Ashley! Ashley! She was right here! She got she she like, like, oh, oh, oh. Turn on your dryer. Roasty toasty electric fire for Nick. Is that the clue? I guess we gotta go to my laundry room. Are you sure? Well, that is what it says. It is for me. You have 10 days till Christmas Eve. Fail and you'll never see Ashley again. Santa's little helper. I think we know what we have to do. against the evil elf and ignite to ash, they must continue their journey. Somewhere at Kat's residence lies a rare ornament that will allow the three to contact Ashley. Okay, let's not waste time, let's go. I wonder which ornament it could be. Maybe one of the green ones? Or it's the giant clear one that's completely out of place. Um... <gasps> no, why would you do that? Was that Ashley? You killed her! I, I didn't kill her! I don't think that was supposed to happen. How are we supposed to get her back now? There's no other stories written. We lost our only chance. I, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I don't understand why that stupid book chose us to torture. What did we ever do? What if we never get her back? Guys, it's been days and all we've done is sit around. It's no use. Ashley's gone. Uh, what the fruitcake? Did you just try to slip? Oh. What the holly? Okay, why can't we swear? Check the book for a new story. While the three sit and sulk, candy canes rain down upon them. They must search for the one rainbow candy cane as there's a special message hidden with it. Oh. 
Hey idiots, it's Ashley. I'm still missing, you know. You're taking too long, so I found my own way. Meet me at the bridge on Ellswood Street at 5 p.m. Where is she? It's 5 p.m. She said she'd be here. Who is that? It's Santa. Oh, I don't think that's Santa. Didn't he fall off Ashley's roof? Ho, ho, ho. You guys are so gullible. Where's Ashley? She's not coming. She never was. I wrote that note to get you here. But why? Because I have a gift for you. Is that a sand timer? Sure. You have until the sand runs out to get Ashley back. What? But the book said we have until Christmas Eve. I choose the rules, and I choose the sand timer. That's, That's not fair. fair! You can't do that! First so I was like, you I Ashley, and like... now you... Oh, we're at Ashley's house. What is all this? Where's the book? What does it say? It's a ritual. To get back Ashley? Place the baby angels, gingerbread men, and candy canes in a triangle on the table. Pour the Christmas sprinkles in a circle to keep the evil elves away. You must all wear Santa hats. As you recite, in Santa we trust to bargain presents for milk and cookies as we chant your sacred words, ho, ho, ho. In Santa we trust to bargain presents for milk and cookies as we chant your sacred words, ho, 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 ho. Guys, there's something else in the book. Are you kidding me? What is it? On Christmas Day, you must wrap up this book and deliver it as a present. If you fail to do this, this book will haunt you for another year. Oh, oh fruitcake! Fruit cake. Are we sure about this? It's gonna ruin their whole Christmas. I mean, it's what the book says. It's technically not our problem anymore. Christmas time. 